Hi, this is Eric, and this is another DIY RV adventure. This is my DeWalt adapter. It has a 20 volt to 12 volt converter. You just simply slide it in like typical DeWalt battery connectors. I'll, pl I'll go ahead and plug this in. It's just a universal connector that I put on it, on this. This has a momentary um, reversing switch, which allows me to um, control the motor both in forward and reverse. These are my uh, uh, cables I made for my adapter. The one on the lo lower left, uh, the black one, is the uh, one that connects to your motors. Um, the the one, one at the bottom is uh, for like a DIY. If you want to make the cable that goes to the motors, it would be a whole lot cheaper uh, doing it that way versus buying that uh, cable. Um, the one on in the middle with the one and the two on it is to control two motors at the same time. And the one on the right is to is a, an extension. It's a 16 foot extension. I would probably make it about a 25 foot. Um, that way you get plenty of uh, length when you're working um, on the outside of the RV and you're coming down to the ground and you want to control your uh, slide, um, I'd make it a little bit longer. What I'm about to show you is uh, me connecting the, the middle cable with the one and two to the wires going from the motor to your control, to the RV's um, slide controller. So... I'm going to unplug it from the slide controller and plug it into these cables. And what I'm going to, going to do is I'm going to control the slide from my uh, adapter. So I'm going to power it, both motors, moving the slide out and in using that DeWalt battery. As you can see, I'm controlling both motors moving the slide in and out. One motor is going forward, one motor is going in reverse. Power is coming directly from the DeWalt battery and nothing else. This will allow me to test the cables and also to control the slides uh, manually outside of the RV if I need to do any kind of maintenance or anything like that. One use for this would be uh, if there is a problem with your uh, controller, your motor controller, you can uh, still move your slide in and out without using the motor controller. But caution does need to be used. If you liked the video, please hit the like. My next video is going to be about my RV solar tilting. If you'd like to see that video, please hit the subscribe and it'll let you know as soon as it comes out. Thank you.